Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you something very unusual. I've never shown you this before. So um, I'm showing you this thing. I don't know if you can, I don't know if I should call it a snack. I think it's a snack, yeah. It's a snack. So it's basically edible clay. It is edible clay, did you know? Is natural like we eat this um eat this in congo and uh, we call it mabili be careful how you say it because it's the same word can mean a completely different thing you know but um this is how it looks like edible clay i think is um i don't know if it's sun-dried or baked i'm not sure but um it's just nice and salty and crunchy <laughs> My mouth is just so watery as I'm talking about it, and it's just there staring at me like, pick me up, eat me, eat me now, now, stop talking. <laughs> Before I taste it, I'm tell you guys how it tastes like, but um, I just want to let you know that um, this uh, is eaten a lot in Congo uh, by women that are pregnant. Um, I mentioned it on my on my YouTube channel one time, and then people were saying something like. Um, do you know, like when women are pregnant, they crave like, you know, things like this. So that's why they crave it. That's why they eat it. But I don't really know if it's healthy to eat it while you're pregnant or not. Or probably because like, I don't know, if you've been eating it since you were younger and uh, your body's kind of used to it. I don't know. I don't really know if it's safe. But all I know, it tastes so damn good. But yeah, it's one of those snacks that once you eat it. It's so hard to stop. You can just carry on like you, you think I'm just gonna have one, then it turns to two, then it turns to three, then by the time you realize it's all gone, it's all finished. But um, this is it, and I'm gonna try it for you guys. Mm, it's so crunchy. Mm. Mm. It's so hard to explain how it actually tastes like. How you can hear it, you probably think that I'm eating sand. Like dried sand or um, baked sand it's basically just clay chalk clay um i'm trying to find i'm trying to find a good word of explaining it that is so addictive super addictive how many have got left Mm. Oh, so good. If you haven't eaten this before, I don't know if I advise you to swallow it. You can try it. So you can chew it, try it. But if you swallow it, your stomach will not take it because if your body's not used to it. Because this. The toilet, you're gonna suffer. <laughs> the toilet, it's no friend. Literally, no friend. You can't eat too much of this because you know what's gonna happen. Constipation. Mm. So good. So good, though. Basically, it basically tastes like, it basically tastes like sand. I don't know how sand tastes like, but. Maybe it feels like sand. It feels like sand, and it sounds like sand. Yeah. So if I had to explain it, it it tastes a bit earthy. It tastes like earth. If you know what I mean, it tastes like earth. It tastes like salted sand, um, baked salted sand. I don't know. How would you describe it? Like seriously. 
I don't know how you can describe this thing, but um, mm. yeah, this is what I'm saying, guys. Once you eat it, you cannot stop. Mm. It's so good. It was so chill. Mm. I don't know if you can see it. I'll try to put a picture there. Oh, that's my sister there. Okay. I'll try to put a picture somewhere here or there so you can see how it actually looks like because I don't know if you can see it properly. But that's it for me. I can't eat anymore because if I do, if I eat more, I'm going to finish it because it's that addictive. But um, if you tried it before, let me know in the comment section below. And let me know the actual name of it because I know you, you call it my belly in um, Lingala, but I want to know what type of clay it is because I bought different clay as well. I bought one clay. Uh, I bought clay from um, I think it's Cameroon. I bought it, I bought um, you can purchase this at the Congolese shop. So I bet my lips looking dry because of the clay. Excuse me, but um. Yeah, guys, so um, thank you so much for watching, and um, I'll speak to you all in my next one. Bye.